in this episode of Kingdoms and Castles. <laughs> Look at the amount of ships, holy shit. And so many ogres, what the fuck? Oh lord, this is not good at all. Hello everyone and welcome back. Last time we caused some chaos on Queen Lashir's land. I have no idea how she is doing at the moment. We could send our spies to spy on her again. But today I wanted to make a special episode where we focus on the comments and tips and tricks that you guys have sent. There were so many comments on how to actually improve our place. So we will try and implement all of those tips and tricks in this episode into our kingdom. Combining two of the tips together, there was a tip that we can actually construct the fishing huts on shallow water. And then there was another one where one of the viewers suggested that we will build walls all around our place. So there will be no land for the Vikings to actually land on. So we can dictate where the Vikings land. So I will actually destroy these fishing huts, sorry fisheries. And we will take the walls all the way over here. So we have to change this a little bit. <laughs> The guys who were manning the weapons just float there, okay. Uh, oh, my people know how to levitate. Interesting. But yeah, like this, and then we can make a gate right here. That allows our people to go into the fishing huts. And yeah, we can just place the fishing huts right there. Okay. That is actually really useful. Oh, our people are not happy. Taverns are too crowded. Okay, um, I will make you some new taverns. Do not worry, guys. There we go, a new tavern. Also, this side is almost ready. With the walls all the way out there. And these I'm destructing with moats. So, this side is okay. This side is okay. Then we need to work on this side a lot. And here as well. There was also a tip that if we have a straight way to our keep, like not protected by walls or anything, the Vikings will not bring ogres with them. So I might try destroying like these two gates and making like a walls all around here with just like archers and leaving this place here for the Vikings to land. I'm not sure if that will work, but we'll see. Hey, the Vikings might is finally off cooldown, so we could try that next time the Vikings attack. There is still four more years till the Vikings attack. We'll try that. Actually, let's go check on Lashir. How's she doing? Very unfavorable. She doesn't have money for her archer towers. Okay. And she doesn't have anyone manning the... Oh, she put guys to the ballistas when the dragon attacked. She's starting to rebuild. She has some farms now. Okay. Hmm. We could go to Rise and destroy her farms a bit. But I'm not going to conquer her in this episode. Okay, we should have this side ready for the walls. I will just wall it off right here. I expanded it a little bit, because I want the maximum size for our kingdom. You know, let's send a diplomat. What do you have to say? I've been monitoring the war against Queen Lashier. Queen Lashier wants to come to a peace argument. Agreement, sorry. They are willing to pay 250 gold to end the war. Good, let's end the war. Oh, thank goodness, what a relief. Consider this war over. We are victorious! <laughs> you should take half of the gold. Hey. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. Because we don't need the money at the moment. We are rich. We have 6,000 gold. We are still restoring the peace. Cheers. And the Vikings are here. Alright. Let's see. The Vikings are landing over here. I will just take all the archers over here. Knights over here, and let's see the Vikings might. Putung! These Vikings will regret 
ever coming here. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, okay, so it just instantly kills us every single Viking. Okay, that is good to know, good to know. Now I understand why it has such a long cooldown, like holy shit, 35 years. Okay, Green is sending a diplomat. What do you have to say? <laughs> she wants peace and now she's like, hey, I demand you pay me money. We have a message from our ruler. Yes, go on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I demand tribute. I am no longer asking nicely. I need this much from you, 700. No, not yet. I've given you enough chances. Such disrespect. This is war! <laughs> oh, that concludes our ruler's message. Okay, well, that was fast. They were like, hey, we want peace. Hey, I want your money. You don't give me your money? This is war. <laughs> Queen Lashier is... She's special. <laughs> okay, the tunnel to our keep is ready. I will try demolishing these. And we'll see if the ogres stop spawning. Actually, there is one more hole. There we go. So yeah, I will just fill these walls with archers and the plan is for the vikings to land here and just bring normal vikings with them, with no ogres. They will just walk down the path and die to the archers, at least in theory. I have no idea how this is going to work or if I have to wall these areas off before that will happen. I'm not sure, we'll see. Dragons have been sighted, let's see. Yeah, there are still the same dragon attacks. I wish there would be like a some massive dragon that just comes like a golden dragon. Like in Heroes of Might and Magic 3. That would be cool. Like it would just fly over your kingdom and just spew fire like from here to the whole way through your kingdom. Like just absolutely destroying everything. Like, yeah, that would be annoying, but that would be cool. <laughs> Hello, yellow. My friend, I have something important to talk about. Of course, go on. I have ruled my people for a long time. It's time for me to step down and pass my crown to another. I think of you as a dear friend and our kingdoms as one. It would be a great honor if you would take over for me and rule over my kingdom. The honor is mine, I accept. I'm sorry, I can't right now. I could never do that. Your people love you. Ruler will not ask again. I am really tempted. I am super tempted. But maybe another time. If I say this, the ruler will never ask again, meaning that if I say I'm sorry I can't right now, he will come and ask again. So maybe later. But that is cool. I'm sorry, I can't right now. Of course, no worries. Perhaps you'll change your mind later. That concludes our ruler's message. Farewell. That is weird. That is cool though. We would have gotten this whole kingdom to rule as well. Hmm. Just for that, let's make him a gift. Of 100. 100. 1000 gold. Let's give him some fish as well. Let's give him some apples. Let's give him some meat. Some food. Like, whatever he wants, whatever he needs, we will bring. Except stone and charcoal. I'm sorry, those are mine. Make a gift. That will be a huge gift. Like, he was struggling with food before. He still is, damn. Like, I've been selling him a lot of food, but I'll just give him food. 
We have a message from our ruler. Yes, go on. I see you have fought off our last attack, but... Your last attack? What attack? I didn't even see an attack, but... I demand you surrender. <laughs> and pay 3000 as punishment for this war. Will you pay up? Please? No, the fighting will continue, <laughs> so be it. That concludes our ruler's message. Farewell. I honestly haven't even noticed her troops, so yeah. Good luck. Okay, the Vikings are invading. Let's see. Yeah, they just landed here. Hmm. Is there any land even there? No, they just decided to land right there. Okay, well... We'll try again with all the walls completed, etc. The plan didn't work. <laughs> and they have ogres with them. But there is clearly a path to the keep. They just decided to attack over here. Hmm, interesting. They are destroying a lot of walls, but that's fine. Hey, 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 hey. Why are you attacking my archers? Leave my archers alone. Knights, can you go here? Oh shit, we actually lost a lot of knights. Interesting, interesting. Oh, but they are attacking over here as well. And here they didn't bring any ogres. Okay, so I might need to make... You guys are seeing this as well, right? What? What? Okay, the tower is just bugged. But yeah, uh, I might want to or need to make a pathway over here as well to the keep. So wherever they land, they would have a clear pathway to the keep and they will not bring ogres. Maybe. Like, yeah, this clearly didn't work. Like, it was planned, but that's fine. Okay, we lost a lot of people, so I will start some parties and festivals. There we go. Try to bump up our happiness to 100. There we go. Okay, I gathered my troops and I will go pay Green a visit. The three times speed just makes them into motorboats. Holy shit. <laughs> Good luck, dudes. Alright, troops. Over here over here and this time i will send catapults over here green has built some defenses back but yeah i will just destroy her food production again okay there we go that's pretty much all of the farms from here and i will take down her fisheries as well I think that is enough damage that we have dealt. We lost one ship full of knights. And yep, that's not too big of a loss. What happened over here? Is this the dragons or the Queen's diplomat? What happened? <laughs> we have a message from our ruler. Yes, go on. I see you have fought off our last attack. I still did not notice your attack. But I demand you surrender. Um, no. 3,500 coins. Uh, no. <laughs> you deny my generous offers again. Arg. I can see I'm getting nowhere with you. Yeah, yeah. You will regret this. <laughs> sure. I happen to know that you have no military. And your people are really struggling, so... Yeah, I don't think we will regret not paying green, but okay. Is our gift ready? And no, it's not quite ready yet. Oh, we are... Damn, we don't have iron. That's why. Okay, next time the merchant comes, I will just buy all the iron and I will send the gift away. Okay, I made another free access point for the Vikings right here. So there is nothing blocking their way to the keep. So maybe...
this is enough that we have one on this side and one on this side. Or maybe we need one over here as well as over here. We'll see if this works. Oh, the Vikings are going to attack over here. Interesting. Not enough. Oh yeah, this is our raid. And they have ogres. Okay, I might need to make a free access point from here as well. Holy shit, our guys got melted. Ooh, okay. We have zero knights left. And our archers are going around the walls. Uh, okay, this is not going too well. <laughs> Look at the amount of ships, holy shit. And so many ogres, what the fuck. Oh lord. This is not good at all. Cemetery caretaker has run out of space. In a cemetery. Okay, there is still space over here. The other cemetery is full, yeah. Damn. There were so many ogres though, holy shit. <sighs> okay. Well, the ogres created another passageway from here to there, so I will just make it into a passage. But I will just wall these off and build some archers on top of those walls. The Vikings bugged again. Like, well, this is technically not a bug, but there is one Viking catapult just destroying last year's place. And this time, I will not do anything about that. <laughs> like, the catapult can do our job for us, so I'm perfectly fine with that. Okay, merchant, finally. Uh, we will buy all of your iron so we can uh, finish the gift. Be yellow. All the Hall of Diplomacy people just run to the iron. Nice. Okay, we finally have the gift ready. Uh, where is our diplomat? Over here. Okay. There we go. We picked up the gift of a lot of stuff. Oh, there is only 11 iron. Oh, interesting. We just didn't have 11 iron. Hello, yellow. My friend, request audience. What shall we speak of? I have a gift. A gift for me. Oh, delightful. What a nice surprise. Thank you. What shall we speak of? Let's chat. Harvest time is my favorite time of the year. To be outside in nature tending the crops. That's where I might be if I weren't ruling the kingdom. Sometimes I wonder if I'm cut out for this. Ruling is difficult. It's not for everyone. I think you are. You do the best for your people. Yep. Thank you. Glad to have someone on my side. If someone were to take over for me, I'd retire and spend the rest of the days in my garden for sure. Sounds lovely. You think so too? Yeah. What shall we speak of? Nothing for now. Bye bye. Okay, hopefully Yellow will be able to feed his people with that. Like at the moment, there is few people that are starving and few are actually red. But there is so much food going around now. You're welcome, Yellow. Okay, in this episode, we didn't manage to make this pathway to our keep tip work. But next time, we will try again and hopefully we will get it to work, because holy shit, the ogres are getting out of hand. There were so many in the last raid as well, like, we cannot defend against that. <laughs> Not at the moment, at least. Thank you for all of your tips and tricks in the comments, I really appreciate every single one of them, and thank you for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this episode, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!